afternoon. I sincerely hope this holiday, this holiday season will drain the poison that has infected our politics and set us against one another. I hope this Christmas season marks a fresh start for our nation, because there's so much that unites us as Americans, so much more that unites us than divides us, so mean, so partisan. And too often we see each other as enemies, not as neighbors. So my hope this Christmas season is that we take a few moments of quiet reflection, find that stillness in the heart of Christmas that's at the heart of Christmas, and look, really look at each other, not as Democrats or Republicans, not as members of Team Red or Team Blue, but as who we really are, fellow Americans. The strength, the determination, the resilience, that's long-defined America. We're surely making progress. Things are getting better. COVID law no longer controls our lives. Our kids are back in school. People are back to work. In fact, more people are working than ever before. Americans are building again, innovating again, dreaming again. And it was 1968 that the most terrible year of years, the year of assassination and riot, of war and chaos, May I wish you, and for you, and for our nation, now and always, is that we'll live in the light, the light of liberty and hope, of love and generosity, of kindness and compassion, of dignity and decency. So from the Biden family, we wish you and your family peace, joy, health, and happiness. Merry Christmas, happy holidays, and all the best in the new year. God bless you all, and may God protect our troops. Thank you.